Hi guys, my name is Dr. Manali. I am one of the pelvic floor physical therapists here at Legacy Therapy. And today I wanted to talk to you guys about the pudendal nerve. Um, this is one of the most talked about nerves when it regards the pelvic floor. It has a huge impact on our pelvic floor. And the pudendal nerve, so it has three major functions that I'm going to highlight today. The first one is it provides a lot of bladder help as far as making sure that you stay continent. The second one is bowel function. It has a role in making sure that the anal sphincter is closed and making sure that that you remain bowel continent. The third one is sensory information. So this nerve provides a lot of sensory information regarding touch, pressure, pain, temperature in and around the penis, vagina, and the anal canal and the anus itself. Um, so when there's an issue with this nerve, you can see how it can provide a lot of discomfort in and around the pelvic floor. The most common diagnosis that we see regarding the pudendal nerve is pudendal nerve entrapment. So this is when the nerve is compressed or squished down as it leaves or enters the pelvis through the entrances formed by our ligaments and our muscles. And it can be entrapped or squished down on anywhere on its route through the body. Um, when this nerve is not functioning, it can cause a lot of symptoms that include sensory changes and pain. So you might experience pain that's consistently there or intermittently there, depending on if the nerve is being squished down at that point or not. And this can be kind of described as burning, shooting, or a prickling sensation throughout the areas of the pelvic floor. You may also experience urinary or bowel frequency or urgency since it has a big factor in making sure that you stay continent. Um, there may be some pain with sex as well. And the pain can likely be worse in sitting when you're sitting down on the pelvis itself, squishing down on that nerve versus in laying down or standing positions. Since the pudendal nerve is so important in the pelvic floor, pelvic floor physical therapists are actually one of the main go-tos as far as treating this um, entrapment and can provide a lot of relief to you. Um, and so when we have a patient that comes in with pudendal nerve, suspected pudendal nerve entrapment, um, we do a thorough assessment to really look at the muscles and, and the nerve route, any connective tissue that is impacting the pudendal nerve route. And then we focus our treatments based on what we're finding there. So some of those treatments can include manual techniques to reduce any muscle tension there, teaching you treatment techniques to relieve tension, working on posture, um, exercises that can help release and reduce any tension surrounding the nerve um, and providing good stability exercises to support the surrounding areas to reduce impact on the pudendal nerve. So that's kind of one of the biggest uh, things that we provide as far as pelvic floor physical therapy goes to treat pudendal nerve. Um, so if you feel like you are uh, being impacted by this, have really similar symptoms by this, um, come and talk to us one-on-one -on -one to kind of dive into more about how we can help you with this. Have a good day.